There are four main billing reports in Brightwell Billing. The aging report gives an overview of any past due balances. The billing transaction report gives an overview of all the transactions at your center. For example, all the charges, offline and online payments, and credits, etc. The deposits report shows all the deposits that have been made into your center's bank account. Lastly, the billing summary report provides a summary of all charges, credits, and payments for a given date range. At any time, you can see the total amount owed and the amount that is past due, which is part of the total amount owed. As mentioned before, the aging report gives an overview of all the past due balances at your center. Which student has the past due balance and the amount of days that the balance is past due? You can see the name of the student on the left and the amount that is past due, and then the number of days the balance is past due, depending on the column that it's in. If you charge late fees at your center, this is a clear way to see which payments are past due and who you need to send late payments to. Lastly, you can export this report and it will send a CSV file to your email. You can download it and use it in your spreadsheet tool if you like. The billing transaction report shows all transactions at your center for a specific date range. You will see the charges, credits, offline payments, and online payments that have been made. You can use the refine by box to filter what date you are looking for. For example, if you want to see all payments that have been made, you can use the drop down under transaction type and click on online payment and offline payment. Then create report to see all the payments. Lastly, you can export the report and it will send a CSV file to your email. You can download it and use it in your spreadsheet tool as needed. You can also decide what information you would like the export to show. For example, if you want to take out the student ID column, you can uncheck the box next to it. Next, let's cover the deposits report. The deposits report will show all the deposits that have been made into your bank account. Deposits are made in a bulk amount on a daily basis. You will see the bulk amount listed here and the date it was deposited. If you want to see the itemized amount that makes up the bulk deposit, you will need to export the report. Similar to the last two reports, you can export the deposit report. It will send a CSV file to your email and you can download it and use it in your spreadsheet tool. Lastly, the billing summary report provides administrators with a high level view of all charges, credits, and payments. A center has occurred over a given date range. This report will display cumulative transaction totals that are separated based on their category. This report is compatible with the profit and loss statement. You can export the billing summary report. It will send a CSV file to your email and you can download it and use it in your spreadsheet tool. If you have any questions, please contact us at support at mybrightwheel.com.